This is the Little Free Art Gallery located at Aurora Town Park. So with the art gallery, you can leave some art, you can take some art, or you can just appreciate the art that has been already shared with us. There's some beautiful pieces in here too, so anybody can contribute anything? Absolutely. We just ask that you ensure that the art is appropriate for all ages, is respectful for everybody in the community, and anybody is welcome to take some art, leave some art, or just to enjoy, reflect, and appreciate what's there. Do you think it might inspire somebody to go home and make a little piece of art themselves? I do, and I think it has, um, and we really hope that it continues to do so. I'm not really sure how you wouldn't be inspired um, by having a look at all the different pieces that are here, and even just the mediums that are have been uh, provided so far, it's, it's great to see. So what do we have in here today? Okay, so you can see there's a painting on canvas, which is using some great colors. That's very beautiful. Some more canvas. These are beautiful. Look at that. This framed piece here, which looks like it's painted on newspaper. I think it's a wooden butterfly. And it's not just about sharing the art. You can actually take a piece of art and take it home with you. Take it home and keep it and enjoy it. How much turnover have you seen? Like, is it being used? It is being used. Yeah, we were very excited to see how full it is. Uh, so it's wonderful to see it's picking up in the community. What do you think it contributes to the community? Why have this? I think it's a great way to introduce art in public spaces to the community. It's a great way to express yourself and your own creativity, but it's also a great way to connect the community, to see what other people have created and to look at what they've put into it and to connect on that type of a level as a community. I think it's just wonderful. In fact, it is doing so well that a second little free art gallery has already been built and will be installed in the spring. They're hoping that they'll inspire other communities to create their own. In Aurora, Audra Brown, City News.